How to upgrade your Godox lighting and flash systems. Now, I didn't find any videos on this, and I'm not going to teach you how to unzip in that. Most people should know how to do that by now. But when you upgrade your Godox products, and because I have the USR3, I had to do that. Well, my flash unit was a G1 firm upgrade. So I had one of these here is what I needed. Okay, so I downloaded the one I needed. And then you'll notice at the top here, it has the firmware upgrade software. You need the firmware upgrade software, so you're going to need to download that first. And then you can get your driver, whatever you want to call it, your firmware. And you will run this. You will load this. Basically, you'll run the firmware upgrade software. Then you will download whichever one's yours. And then you will load this in. Now, when you do this upgrade, pull the batteries out of your flash unit pull them out of your remote sensor, whatever you got, and then plug the USB cable in. Your computer will go ding, ding, ding. It'll find it. Then you're going to run your G1 firmware upgrade, and then you're going to run your... Well, you're actually going to tell it what file. Let me show you that. So over here, this is the program of the G1. You'll actually select the file, and it will connect, and then you will perform the upgrade. It's like two or three clicks. Down here in the bottom left, you'll see where it says Chinese or English. Click that button. If you can't see it, and I had that problem. It was really, really tiny, and I couldn't stretch it out, but there was a line there. I clicked the line, and then it switched over to English, and then I could see the buttons well enough to get the upgrade performed. It's what I did. So, here was my problem. So, I downloaded the firmware upgrade software here. I downloaded my flash, whatever it was. It was a T or something. But I downloaded it. Then I upgraded and everything was fine. I thought, okay, great. Then I came down here and I also needed to get the um, X Pro C, which is the wireless that sits on my camera and the flash can be anywhere else. So I downloaded that, right? Well, then I loaded my, you know, my firmware upgrade software, but it wasn't finding that file. And for like 20 minutes, I was scratching my head. I was like, what's going on? Well, all of a sudden, I noticed, wait a minute, this has got a different firmware upgrade. And you go down to G3, oh, wait a minute, this has got a different firmware upgrade. So here's what's going on. If whatever firmware upgrade you're downloading, let's say I download it in this table, the G1 table, okay? then I'm going to need the G1 firmware upgrade. If I download another one from the G2 table, as you can see, I'm going to need this firmware upgrade to upgrade these. Or if you're downloading one from the G3 firmware upgrade, you're going to need one of these to upgrade these down here. So I needed two different firmware upgrade software to update what I had. That was a bit confusing. So you'd think they would have had one firmware upgrade program that would just kind of do them all. But they didn't do that. So if you're upgrading your Godox products, when you look at this website, and I'll have a link at the bottom, keep in mind that you're operating by the table. So like I said, if your firmware is here, and you're going to need the G1 firm upgrade. If your firmware is in G2, you're going to need that upgrade. If you got different products with different ones, you're going to have to download two or three of them. And it's pretty easy once you figure it out. Pull the batteries, plug it in, then load the uh, firmware upgrade software. And then actually you go find whatever one you're going to put in and it updates it pretty quick. But this kind of threw me for a loop. But pay attention to the table you're in and it should go really smooth for upgrading. And I'll have the link for where you download the actual firmwares. And I'll even have a link for this just in case you can't see yours very good. So you can have a look at it. Okay. Catch you guys later.